Hey YouTube, it's Dimitri, and today I'm gonna do a quick update real quick. So New York City here this next week, which is going to be um, October 4th. So I'm gonna do another coffee meetup here, New York City, uh, Blue Bottle Coffee on 54 West 40th Street. Um, it's right next to Bryant Park. So anyways, you wanna grab a coffee, uh, you can meet me up here on October 4th. It'll be at 3 p.m. So just like the Chicago event. Um, just other updates as well here. So Chicago was awesome. I had a blast. Uh, the coffee meetup was one person, which at first I was like, oh, you know, it's kind of be cool to meet like a bunch of subscribers. But just having one person was great. Um, so I met William. Uh, anyways, and we had just had a great conversation and it was just great. They could just ask questions uh, have a conversation and really get into the nitty gritty details. So for YouTube videos, I wish I could do more of this like interesting leading questions. Uh, but the way that YouTube works, I typically have to pick a topic and then do a video on it. And then people, will, you know, drive traffic based on that one idea. But it was great having a conversation about that. Uh, the trading show as well is pretty great. I met a few subscribers there. So if you were there, there's a few of you. It was awesome just to chat with you guys. Uh, one individual is in the industry, so it's good to kind of pick their brain about, you know, uh, data, ESG, uh, modeling, trading, and those sorts of topics and just see what they're working on and, you know, how they look at things and how their business does things. Uh, and then there's also another student that came up, which is awesome. So they came up from Florida. Again, Q&A time was great, just answering questions for people, um, answering questions like I would never have thought to have answered or to make videos on. So that was a lot of fun. Uh, also, I had dinner with Ollie. So if you look on this channel, you search Dimitri Bianco, Ollie. Uh, we did a great interview with him, uh, I think it was like a year, maybe two years ago. It was an undergrad. He's now working in Chicago at a trading firm. I had dinner with him. That was great just catching up, like old time sakes. Basically, like instead of doing it, you know, virtually, got to meet him in person, which was great. And then finally, the centralized versus decentralized was originally a debate. They turned it into a fireside discussion. It was 20 minutes. Um, it's a whole other topic in itself, but it went fine. Uh, we briefly had some discussions about it. We had some chats. Um, the trading show in general was, eh, it was okay. It was not great. Uh, it was really just this big marketing presentation, which in many ways, I guess I probably shouldn't have been as surprised as I was. There was hardly any quants at the entire thing. Uh, it was mainly just a bunch of super jazzed up, excited DeFi enthusiasts uh, who thought cryptocurrencies rule the world. And basically, that's kind of their whole focus. A lot of the trading vendors that came to are like, you know, we can provide you all these great products for trading on cryptos. And the main sponsor of the entire show, again, was uh, just cryptocurrency based in DeFi. So I shouldn't have been surprised that the whole thing was basically skewed to just DeFi. Um Anyways, there was one good presentation. I already knew the individual, I've seen them present in the past, so I knew that was going to be good on alt data. Uh, but other than that, it was yeah, so so. I I don't know if I'd go back and present or not. But anyways, those are my two cents. Um, anyway, so New York City though, this Tuesday, October fourth, three p.m. Blue Bottle Coffee off of Fortieth by Bryant Park. I will see you guys there if you want to come, just hang out and chat. Um, if you were at Rutgers or Fordham, no worries. Uh, Rutgers and Newark, of course. Uh, I will see you guys um, on Wednesday the 5th. So anyways, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. And as always, until next time.